This is the second year that KC Masterpiece has partnered with Barbecue for Our Troops to host barbecues at military bases across the country. It's a great organization that's committed to giving, to giving back to those that have just sacrificed so much for our country. And we're proud to serve those who, who, who serve our country. And uh, we've donated 50,000, KC Masterpiece has donated $50,000 this year to host up to 10 events. Uh, we encourage you to check out grilling.com to find out ways that you can find out about future Barbecue for Our Troops events, as well as visit barbecueforourtroops.com and uh, help donate to this great cause so we can host Hi, more King. barbecues like I'm this across the country. I'm with Barbecue for Our Troops, and we're in uh, Nellis Air Force Base, 10 miles north of Las Vegas, and we're doing an event where we're cooking for the troops. We're serving it tomorrow. We got to cook tonight, and we got pork butt that we're cooking tonight. And we'll do two cooks tonight of pork butt, and tomorrow we'll throw on some chicken and get that done before the troops come over. And we'll serve them eleven till the food runs out. You know, uh, been doing this now since the war started. I'd say it's eight nine years. And we've gone all over the country doing them. You know, I'm lucky enough that KC Masterpiece last year paid for five barbecues. They made it possible to where I could go to five different bases in the United States and do these barbecues. I've been to Whitman Air Force Base, home of the B-2 bombers. Been to Bamsey, Brooks Army Medical Center down in Fort Sam Houston, San Antonio, Texas, where the wounded warriors are. We were able to go there and do a barbecue for the wounded warriors and give them something where they could just enjoy a day away from all the medical stuff and just relax and be normal people again. You know, it's very touching. You know, I've t this year I've been up to Port Wainimi. We did a CB battalion that just came back. You know, they were over in Afghanistan, and they did their tour, came back, and I was fortunate enough that I was asked to be part of the welcome home. We went up and we cooked for them, and it's, they're a great group of people. Been to Camp Lejeune. We've done, I've done three barbecues back there. You know, Fort Bragg, North Carolina, Fort Campbell, Kentucky. We've been all over the United States doing these for the past eight years <clears throat> and just want to keep doing them. You know, it is, doesn't matter how you feel about the war, it's supporting the troops. They go out and they do the job that they're asked to do. They don't have any way of getting around it. It's very important just to support them. Now, if somebody would like to send you somebody to help you out, what would they do? Uh, I've got a website, www.bbq4rtroops.com, and it's got my address where they can mail a check or they can make a donation through PayPal. You know, it's real simple. PayPal gets their little cut of it, but it's a simple way to where they can donate with their credit card if need be. And how much do you get paid? Nothing. Uh, how much do you get paid? Nothing. How I haven't. You get paid depreciation by the troops. Come on, let's say that because that's what it is. That is beyond statement. You know, it's that's worth more money than what they could give me in the world. You know, I'm from Vietnam era. We weren't treated good. You know, they'd rather spit at us than to look at us. And I made a promise that these guys would not go through what I went through. And... How about your serving crew? All those are volunteers, too. All volunteers. Everybody volunteers. You know, I've got a few people that were in the service, but most of the people that come out and to the different events were never in the service. They just want to say thank you. You know, I've got people that 
for this event here. They drove all the way from Southern California, all the way up to Vegas, just to cook all night to serve the troops tomorrow, and then they'll go home. You know, they didn't come up here to spend any money in Vegas and gamble and whatever. They just came up here just to help me to serve the troops. I just want to say I really appreciate uh, KC Masterpiece and uh, Barbecue for the Troop coming out here and holding out this special event for us. It's uh, really nice to see the community giving back to us as uh, we make a lot of sacrifices for our country. And it's, it's just it's nice to see that people appreciate what we do. And I just want to say thank you. Hello, my name is Scott Norton. I'm a former Navy vet. I'm out here at Nellis Air Force Base in Las Vegas cooking for the base personnel. We're expected to have about 1,200 of personnel coming in today, and we've, uh, we, I say myself and the other cookers, have been cooking uh, uh, pork butt all night and some chicken, and we got some uh, beans, and uh, it's uh, sponsored by Casey Masterpiece. They've, they've helped us with the money and supplying us with sauce. And I have a, uh, a student fireman from Bordeaux, France here, and have you ever had American barbecue? Not really, just a little barbecue in fire station, but not like that. Uh, do you understand uh, uh, the barbecuing that we've been doing, how we did it? Yes, yeah. yeah. Uh, it's uh, very special in the uh, U.S., Amer American barbecue. In France, it's really different. It's not also popular. Yeah, we, we spend all night with a very low uh, temperature, uh, 250 degrees, and kind of let the smoke go pass over the meat and cook the meat that way. And that, that's, that's, that's what we call barbecuing. Do you have anything like that in uh, France? No, we don't have like that. It's just a uh, well, different sort of barbecue, not like that. Uh, normally when we barbecue like this, we barbecue uh, pork butt, uh, pork ribs, beef brisket, and chicken. Um, in France, do they barbecue like that or do they barbecue something else? Well, something else, duck. We also cook a duck, uh, herbs of duck, and uh, it's the same meat, uh, chicken. Yeah, it's the same. Okay. Yeah, it's with um, I don't remember turkey. Yeah, turkey in a brochet, little square of turkey. Uh, it's uh, the same. Yeah. Well, thank you very much. Uh, he's one of the volunteers that also came out with. This is my friend uh, Jay Norris. He's a North Las Vegas fireman. Has been for how many years now? 20, 22 years. 22 years of the North Las Vegas fireman. He brought the fire truck here and some of his other uh, firefighters out here also to serve and to pay back to the community and, uh, and show their appreciation for the airmen here. I want to thank you very much uh, for coming out today. You're welcome, Scott. We look forward to uh, helping out the uh, fine uh, active duty uh, personnel here at Nellis Air Force Base and it's just a, a nice opportunity for us to give back to the community like you said. Thank you.